Hey guys, welcome to um, a new walkthrough on Fire Red and Leaf Green version. This is specifically Fire Red, and uh, we're gonna jump right in. Why don't you please join me? We'll jump right into the Pokemon world. Here's the uh, controls. Yes, yes, yes. The usual stuff. Holding your hand at every corner here. Press the A button and let your adventure begin. Professor Oak. Wow, that is a that slow text. Hopefully, we can uh, speed it up after uh, we get through this introduction. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. I sounded like Bane. <laughs> Some people, Pokemon, are pets. <laughs> no, that, I should stop that impression definitely. Yeah, this is very slow, unfortunately. Yep, he studies Pokemon. <laughs> now, tell me, are you a boy or are you a girl? You know, you'd think he could tell if you were a boy or a girl, but... You just have to remind the old man who has, uh... Memory issues. And, uh, yeah. So, my name's George. So, put that in. Now, here is our rival. <laughs> what was his name? I think we'll call him Gary. Let's make it like the anime a bit. <laughs> Can you remember his own grandson? I just find that hilarious. George, your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. World of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go! No, this is my favorite game, guys. Out of all the Pokemon games, I would have to say this is my favorite. It's like a little nap. <laughs> Here's a little trick if you didn't know, you can pick up a potion from uh, your computer. Yeah, I'm gonna speed up the text. It's way too slow. Alright. All oh, boys leave home someday, but usually not at 10 years old. <laughs> and apparently in the Pokemon world, it is uh, absolutely okay to leave your home at 10 years old and uh, to, uh, you know, without uh, food or anything, you know. It's Perfectly fine. Yeah, I need to start remembering more about this game. I haven't played this game in a while, so. Gary! Love the music, just love the music. Hey, wait, don't go out! It's unsafe. <laughs> Protection. <laughs> Fed up waiting. Let me think. Oh, that's right. It's moving too fast for me to read now. So we need to pick a Pokemon out of one of these Pokeballs. So, Gary has to be patient, so we can pick first, but uh, I'd rather pick last because I you know, think Gary would pick the one that's weaker to mine, but whatever. So yes, I'm going to go for Bulbasaur. So there we go. Yes, I think I'll give him a nickname. This is going to be quite a cheesy one, but uh, yeah, I think I'll call him Leafy. I think the audio was a little bit behind. I think it's just the way the recording is. But, uh, I'm sure we can sort that out maybe some other time later in the walkthrough, but I don't think it's that much of an issue. 
I hope I'm not holding the microphone too close to my mouth. I haven't done a walkthrough like this in a very long time. So, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, he wants to take us on. Come on, Gary, I'm not afraid of you. Punk. Look at that hair, what do you think? Who do you think you are? Some cool kid? <laughs> oh, I have a feeling this isn't gonna go well. So, Professor is basically telling me how to battle a uh, train. Yeah. This is gonna be a slug match here. Taco, come on, come on, Taco. Oh, uh, well, damn it! <laughs> that was unexpected. <laughs> no, that's too cheesy. Yeah, so, uh, smell you later, yeah, we just got our eye kicked. Talk to this guy. No, he's incredible. It is indeed. Wow, that my frame rate's really slow, I need to do something to fix that. I'm not going to lose to Pidgey. I'm sorry, I'm not going to lose to Pidgey. <laughs> no! <laughs> please, please, please. Yes. Yeah. We haven't really gotten off to a great start in this, uh, in this, uh, let's play or walkthrough, whatever you want to call it. I think I'll call it a let's play because, to be honest, it's, at the moment I'm not good enough to call it a walkthrough. <laughs> so that's where you get a potion from this guy, this gentleman over here. So, uh, yep. What am I doing? I think that's meant to speed it up, but, uh, it's um no the I definitely have to change the uh frame rate or something on this uh video because it's not running as smooth as I as I would uh as I would like, but uh, yeah we can uh, figure that out soon enough. So what did you guys have for dinner last night? Um I had Did I even have dinner? Yeah I had a pancake, a, a sweet pancake, uh, yeah, like apples and all that in it, was, it was nice. Some sour cream and sugar over it. Yeah. So we're gonna continue our walk into... We're on the road to Viridian City! Yeah, that's a great song, that. And, uh, if you wanna know something, there is a game of this guy who was drunk, I think. So they had to change it, so he was drinking coffee and he... Yeah. That's <laughs> pretty funny, that one. You didn't know, yeah, it's a remake, Fire Red and Leaf Green, remake of the original Red and Blue. And uh, here's our favorite uh, Nurse Joy. I'm definitely not going to speed that up anymore because it's making the, making the gameplay move a lot slower than I would like. So uh, we're going to go into Pokemark and uh, deliver Professor Rook's parcel to this uh, gentleman over here. Or do we just collect the parcel? Oh, I don't know. Really forgetful these days. Oh no. 
I know the Pokemon. We are playing Pokemon, so I should have expected that. No. Uh, just want to deliver deliver this parcel and uh, be done with it. Yay! Um, I was just thinking, if you if you're living in this town, surely the kid's gonna walk into the grass, you know, even if they're not the cool not to, you're not gonna just stay in that town all of your life. But the Pokemon, you know, like most people in Pallet Town don't even have Pokemon, so how are they gonna ever leave without getting food <laughs> or something like that? It is flawed, but you know, great games, great games. So we're gonna go back in uh into the uh the lab here. You have something for me? Okay, so yeah, we're giving him the parcel, yeah. He got a custom Pokeball, so uh, I think he's gonna give us some balls, and then uh, he's gonna, Professor Oak is gonna give us some uh, Pokedexes here. Gonna give one to my rival and give one to me. So we received uh, the Pokeballs here, and uh, yep, that'll be good to catch some Pokemon with. Um, I think we're nearing the end here, might be a few more minutes. So yeah, he's saying it's, um, yeah, we have to uh, complete what he uh, didn't finish. He was going for to uh, complete the Pokedex, but he failed, so we gotta do that for him. last Pokemon and no one's gonna take that it's just gonna sit there forever unfortunately I'm not gonna speed up again well I will but uh, I'll try not to from episode 3 onwards so uh, let's make our way to the, on the road to Viridian City Yeah, we don't want to lose to uh, Rattata, definitely, so I think we're just going to run away this time. I really got off to a bad start. Oh. I usually, 99% of the time I would beat my rival, but uh, he just got the luckier, uh, well not luck skill, he was too skilled for me. He was just too cool with that hairstyle, you know, I couldn't, I couldn't beat that hairstyle, that's what it was. So, uh, we're on the road to Verdian City, and, uh, I think we'll, uh, heal up here. So, uh, guys, I think we'll end up here, and, uh, see you in part two. Uh, please leave a like or comment if you enjoyed the video. See you guys later. See you next time.